so much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Blippi! Hey, it's me, Blippi. And today, we're here at Medieval Times in Orlando, Florida. Whoa! And look at it. It's a giant castle. <laughs> yeah! Whoa. We are at Medieval Times. That was a really long time ago. Like, all the way in the 11th century. Whoa! <laughs> Did you know back in medieval times, people didn't drive in cars? Ring, 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 ring. No, instead they rode horses. <laughs> so silly. Hey, have you ever wondered what it was like in medieval times? Yeah, me too. Well, today, you and I get to go in the Orlando castle and learn all about it. Yeah. And maybe we can even see a real life knight. That would be so cool. <laughs> Come on, let's find out. Whoa, look at it. It's a real life horse. Hello, Mr. Horse. Ah, <laughs> oh, he's so sweet. Today, we're here at the village stable. Yeah. A stable is where the horses get to eat yummy food <laughs> and take naps. <laughs> yeah, and get all ready and geared up for the tournament. <laughs> yeah! Hey, do you know what sound a horse makes? <laughs> yeah, that's right. They neigh. <laughs> neigh. <laughs> neigh. Hey, will you neigh like a horse with me? <laughs> okay, awesome. Here we go. Nay! 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 <laughs> so silly. Well, this is a really nice horse, but how about you and I go help get the horses all geared up for the tournament? Come on, let's go! Whoa! Look at it! This table has all the gear that we're gonna need to get the horses all ready for the tournament! Yeah! And look at this! Whoa! <laughs> yeah! This, this is a brush to help get all the dust and the dirt out of the horse's back. Yeah. <laughs> this is a body brush, so it's for the body of the horse. Whoa. And look at these ones right here. Hey, spiky. <laughs> yeah, these are brushes for the horse's mane and tail. Yeah, they have longer bristles so that they can get through the hair, kind of like the hair on your head. Ooh. <laughs> so silly. Whoa, and look at this. This is everything we need to put on the horse. We have the saddle pad. Yeah, this saddle pad is really soft and squishy. Ooh, squish, 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 squish. <laughs> and this goes on the horse first to make sure that the saddle is super comfy. Yeah. Whoa, and look at it. This is a really big saddle. The saddle can whew, be kind of heavy, and it goes on the back of the horse so that the knights can ride all around. <laughs> and it buckles in, so it's kind of like a belt for the horse. Woo! <laughs> we'll just clip that in, get on top, and ride the horse super fast. <laughs> so silly. Whoa, and this, this is the last thing that we need to put on top of the horse. This is a comparison. Yeah, and this comparison is the color green and brown. <laughs> yeah, good job. Yeah, the comparison helps the knight tell one horse and knight from another horse and knight. So they don't all look the same in their metal armor and the white horses. Yeah, so this comparison, this will go over the saddle last. Well, that's everything we need. Now it's time to get ready to get the horse ready for the tournament. Okay. First, let's grab a brush. Come on. Oh, hello. Hey, look. This is a really beautiful horse. Hello. His name is Humo. Hi, Humo. <laughs> First, let's brush Humo's fur. His hair. <laughs> Horses don't have fur. So silly. <laughs> Yeah, brush, 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 all the dust, brush off all the dust. 
<laughs> yeah. And now that we've cleaned Humo and got all the dust and dirt out of his back, we can put on the saddle pad, the saddle, and the comparison. Let's go. We helped Humo get all dressed up for the tournament. And look, now he's the color green and brown. <laughs> yeah! Well, that was so much fun helping Humo get all geared up. But now I think it's time for you and me to get all dressed up for the tournament ourselves. <laughs> OK, we're about to go, but I think Humo's done a really good job being a horse. And he's had all of his yummy vegetables and fruit for dinner. So we're going to give him a sugar cube. <laughs> Hello? Good job, Humo. Woo! <laughs> that tickles. Woo! <laughs> Humo, you're such a good horsey. Well, now it's time to go get dressed up ourselves. Come on! Hey! It's me, Knight Flippy. <laughs> That's so silly. I'm not a real knight. But today, you and I get to learn about what it was like to be a knight a thousand years ago. Whoa! That was a really long time ago. Have you ever wondered what it was like to be a knight? Hmm, well, you had to be brave and you had to ride horses. Nay, 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 <laughs> so silly. And you had to be strong and kind. Whoa, on second thought, it actually is pretty tricky being a real knight. <laughs> Whoa, <laughs> look at it, a real knight. And now it's time to knight Sir Blippi. I am so excited because you and I don't only get to learn about knights, but I get to become a knight. But first, I need to complete three knights challenges. Whoa, and look at this. This is the first knights challenge. It's called the Big Rings Challenge. <laughs> yeah. So the way to win the Big Rings Challenge is to take a lance, which is like a really long stick, and to put it through two rings in a row. One here, and one way down there. <laughs> if you only get one, you gotta do it again until you get both to complete the Knight's Challenge. <laughs> yeah, this is gonna be so much fun. But first, I need to get some Knight's gear. Come on. <laughs> Whoa, look at this. It's a real life Knight's Lance. Whoa. And this is really heavy. This is what I'm gonna use to try to complete the Big Rings Challenge. Hmm, but what's a knight without its trusty steed? And hey, look, this is my trusty horse, Brownie. Hey, hello, Brownie, hello. Ooh. <laughs> okay, I have my lance and I have Brownie, so we're all ready to do the Knight's Challenge. Let's go. Hey. Okay, here we go. Ready, Brownie? Nay! <laughs> okay, I'm ready to Knight's Challenge! <laughs> Whoa! Uh-oh, I only got one ring. That means that Brownie and I are gonna have to try the Knight's Challenge one more time. Nay! Brownie thinks so too. Okay, let's go. <laughs> okay, let's try this again. I think I can do it. Let's go. <laughs> yeah! Whoa. Whoa, that was really hard. I'm getting tired after that night's challenge, but look. We got both of the rings. <laughs> Thanks, Brownie, for helping me out. Hey! <laughs> that was so much fun. And now it's time to move on to the second night's challenge. Let's go find out. Come on. <laughs> Whoa, Brownie. <laughs> yeah. We completed the first night's challenge. We're really close to becoming a knight. <laughs> yeah. 
Okay, so the second night's challenge is even harder, needing agility and strength and really good horse riding skills. <laughs> yeah, it's called the flag toss. It's when me and another knight will toss a flag back and forth three times. And if you catch it all three times, then you complete the challenge. <laughs> okay, here we go. I'm gonna need a little bit of help. So my friend, Sir David, is gonna help me out. Okay, ready, Sir David? Ready. Okay, here we go. <laughs> One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. <laughs> yeah, we did it. We caught the flag three times. <laughs> this is so much fun. Thanks, Brownie. Nay! <laughs> yeah! Okay, so all we have left is the third challenge. And it's a really, really tricky one. It's called the Knight's Dress Up Challenge. I have to get all geared up with all the night clothes in under 10 seconds. Whoa! I don't think I'm gonna need your help on this one, Brownie. Bye bye I'll see you later at the stables. Nay! <laughs> Whoa. Okay, I think I'm all ready. Put the time on the clock. Here we go. Whoa, this armor is so cool. Yeah, we did it. We did all three of the night's challenges. And now I get to be Night Blippy. Woohoo! I'm so excited that I think you and I should do a victory dance. Okay, here we go. <laughs> that was so awesome. Now I get to be a knight. <laughs> Not so fast, Flippy. Oh, hey, Sir David. There's still two more challenges left. Huh, two more challenges? But we already completed three. Mm, I guess two more won't be so hard. So what are the next two challenges? Well, first you have to learn the knight's code. Whoa, do you know what the knight's code is? Me neither. Uh, Sir David, what's the knight's code? A knight is sworn to valor. Okay, so we need to be really brave. His heart knows only virtue. Okay, so that means, hmm, we'll be really kind. His blade defends the helpless and his might upholds the weak. Hmm, that means you should always help others who need some help. And his words speak only truth. Always tell the truth. <laughs> Those are easy, we can do that. What's the other challenge? Well, the other challenge is the javelin toss. Whoa. That sounds like it's gonna be really, really hard. But hey, I got all my knight's armor and I think we can do it. Yeah, okay, here we go. Ooh. I think I'm all ready to go, come on. Start the knighting ceremony! <laughs> yeah! Okay, here we go. I, Doña Maria Isabella, queen of this castle and ruler of this realm, dubbed the Blippi, once, twice, and thrice as knights of the realm. <laughs> yeah! We did it! <laughs> Good job! Thanks for helping me complete all of the knights' challenges. They were really tricky, but we did a really good job. <laughs> it was so much fun learning all about knights from the 11th century, which was really, really long ago. And it was nice that we learned that knights aren't only strong, but they're kind and they like to help others. <laughs> well, that's the end of this video, but if you want to see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Hey, will you spell my name with me? <laughs> yeah! B-L-I-P-P-I, Flippy! Good job! <laughs> Well, I guess it's Sir Blippi now. <laughs> so silly. Well, I'll see you real soon. Bye-bye! Whoa! Hey! It's me, Blippi, and I'm just out exploring today. Wow! What beautiful land this is. Hey, come on! Whoa! Look at all this tall grass. I wonder what's on the other side. <laughs> Check it out! Yeah! Today, I'm in Tenino, Washington, and this looks like a secret go-kart track. Yeah! Oh, I sure do love go-kart 
go-karts. Have you ever ridden a go-kart before? Yeah, they're so fast. Grabbing that steering wheel, round the corners, this is going to be fun. <laughs> I was just acting like I was driving a go-kart. Oh, speaking of go-karts, yeah, this thing is awesome. Hey, what color go-kart is this? Yeah, the main color of this go-kart is the color red. Yeah, I do like the color red. Hey, look at the number up here. Every go-kart has to have a number, so then you know when you cross the finish line if you won. <laughs> and this number right here, what number is it? One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, this number is five. Wow, whoa, this is so cool. And do you see these wheels and tires? Yeah, they have some dirt and mud on them. Someone must have been racing this go-kart. Yeah, and actually these tires, yeah, they're not normal tires like on a car or a truck, how it has tread. These are nice and flat. Yeah, better for speed. <laughs> oh, hey, look. This is the engine of the go-kart. Whoa, there's so many parts. One way to turn it on is this. You pull it up and then it gets the motor turning and it turns it on. Provides the power so you can go fast. <laughs> Whoa, back here, look at this. This is a chain and this is how the engine provides all the power to the rear wheels and tires. Whoa, I am so excited to ride this. Oh, speaking of riding it, yeah, this is where I'm gonna sit. This is the seat. Oh, it sure does look comfortable, doesn't it? <laughs> Woo, and this is the steering wheel. Do you see when I turn the wheel, it turns the wheels and tires? Whoa, that looks fun. Oh, and last but not least, right up here. This is where you put your feet. Push down right here for the brake. And on the other side, this is for the gas. Speaking of gas, yeah, the engine needs gas. And right here, this is where you fill it up. Okay, it looks like we explored the whole go-kart. So it must be time to drive and race the go-kart. Oh geez, I am so excited. Yeah. Are you ready? Yeah, let's go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Wait a second, I need all my safety gear. Three, two, one. Whoa, check it out. Yeah, my safety gear. Yeah, I have my helmet on, my goggles, my gloves, and that means I am ready to race. Yeah, you have to wear a helmet so then it keeps your head nice and safe. You have to wear gloves so then you can hold on to the steering wheel nice and tight. And you wear, yeah, the goggles, so then dirt and mud doesn't flip in your face. Oh, here I go. Oh, wait a second. <laughs> I forgot to turn on the go-kart. All right, here we go. Oh yeah. Make sure everything's turned on. And remember what I said earlier? We need to give it a pull. Here I go! Another go-kart, and this go-kart is the color black. 
and its number is five, eight, nine. Whoa! Hey, who are you? Kylie. Kylie? Well, it looks like you're my competition. Are you ready to race? Yes. Whoa! Looks like Kylie is ready. Oh, hey, another competitor. Oh, what's your name? Lincoln. Lincoln? Whoa, are you ready to race? Yeah. Who do you think's gonna win? Me. Whoa, that sounds like some tough competition. All right, looks like Lincoln is ready, looks like Kylie is ready, and me, Blippi, is ready to race. All right, let's start those engines. Fun out! Yeah, that was so much fun driving this go kart and racing this go kart. Oh, geez, this red go kart. Yeah, the red number five go kart did me so good today. We had a safe day riding go karts together. Good job. Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? E-L-I-P-P-I, -P -P -I. Flippy. Good job. All right, I should probably take another lap. <laughs> See you soon. Bye-bye. <laughs> Hello. Hey, it's me, Flippy. And look at where we're at. Yeah, we're at Santa, which is in Seattle, Washington. And Santa stands for School of Acrobatics and New Circus Arts. Yeah, have you ever been to a circus before? I love circuses, they are awesome. And today, you and I are gonna learn about some circus arts. <laughs> Wow, look 
Look at this place, it is so cool. And the floor that we're on is pretty bouncy. Whoa! Okay, the first thing I need to do is take off my shoes. All right, there we go. Let me put them right over here. And now, before we do anything with circus, we need to stretch. All right. Oh, whoa. Yeah, it's really important to stretch so then our muscles are nice and loose. So then we don't injure ourselves. Oh yeah, there we go. All right, woo. Oh, I stretched out my back, my legs, my arms. Oh. Now that I'm all stretched, I think we should learn the rules of the circus. Whoa, check them out. The rules of circus. Yeah. Number one, have fun. <laughs> That's pretty easy. We love to have fun. Number two, be safe. Yeah, safety is really important. We definitely don't want to get hurt, do we? No. Number three, work hard. Yeah, I love working hard because it's so fun to start at one point and get to another. And the only way you can improve is working hard. <laughs> and number four, be kind to each other. I love being kind. It's so cool that you are kind to your friends and family. Good job. All right, now it's time for some circus stuff. Woohoo! Check out what I'm on. Woohoo! Yeah! Do you know what this is? Whoa! Yeah, this is a trampoline. Check it out. The bouncy part. Yeah, what color is this? Yeah, this is the color black. Oh, and look at this. A safety pad. Just in case if you go off the center and then you don't get hurt. What color is the safety pad? Yeah, it's the color red. <laughs> All right, let me jump. Woohoo! Can you think of an animal that can jump real high? Whoa! Yeah, how about one that carries its babies in a pouch? Yeah! Yeah, a kangaroo! Boing, boing, boing! Woohoo! What about one that loves to be in the swampy areas and it makes it sound like ribbit? Ribbit. Woohoo! Yeah, frog! Yeah! Woohoo! <laughs> yeah! Jumping is so much fun! Whoa! Did you see that? That was awesome! <laughs> hey, Bleepy! Hey! How are you doing? Yeah, good! That was awesome! Thank you so much! What's your name? My name is Max! Oh, nice to meet you, Max! Do you know how to jump on the trampoline? I sure do. Will you show us? Yeah. Stay right here. Kneel right here and wait for me. OK. Ready? are called aerial silks. Whoa, they're so cool. Yeah, and I am in a green silk and Max is on a purple silk. Whoa, check it out. It's like I'm in a cocoon. Whoa! Yeah. <laughs> Can you think of an insect that hangs out in a cocoon? Whoa! Yeah, they start as a normal insect, then they go in a cocoon, they go through metamorphosis, and then they turn into a butterfly! Yeah! I'm a caterpillar! 
Whoa! Look at Max! He's the butterfly! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Check it out! This is a tight wire. Yeah! This is where you can practice your balance! Yeah! And balance is really important because, yeah, you might need it for things. If you don't have any balance, you'll just fall over. Whoa! You see what I'm using on my hands? Yeah, these are sticks. Just in case, if I need a little help. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> that was silly. I just fell. Let me try it again. Whoa! <laughs> That's tricky. Wow, look at how good she is. Wow, she is so good. Hey, maybe now we can keep balancing on the balls. Wow, look at all these balls. Yeah, this is another great way to learn how to balance. Whoa, check it out. Look at this ball. <laughs> Whoa, whee. <laughs> yeah, I'm balancing on my stomach. Whoa. <laughs> That's hard. But hey, let's count all these balls. All right. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Do you see how this ball's in a circle? Yeah. This actually will stabilize the ball. So then when I try and stand on it, then it won't move around so much. All right. Okay. Let's try this. Whoa. I am so excited. Whoa. 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 It's harder than it looks. Whoa. Whoa. If this stabilizer ring wasn't here, I probably wouldn't be able to do it. Whoa! <laughs> okay, let's see someone good do it. been so much fun learning about all these things circus related. Whoa, check it out. Wow, looks like we have some really cool things like rings. Whoa, yeah, they're so colorful. Hello, hey. <laughs> Ooh, looks like we have some really light scarves. Wow, <laughs> and looks like we have this wood stick. Whoa, what is that for? And a plate? Yeah, a green plate. I know what to do with this. <laughs> wow. Maybe, maybe I could juggle. Wait, he's not juggling. He's balancing. Let's try it out. Whoa, do you see how he just spun it really fast? Yeah. All right, I'm gonna put it on my fingertip. Whoa, check it out. Whoa, 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 that's awesome. <laughs> All right, get ready for this. I'm gonna put it on my forehead and see if I can balance it. Ready? Whoa, whoa. Silly. Okay, let's see what else we have over here. Yeah. Remember the scarves? What color are these scarves? Yeah. This one is the color pink. This one is the color orange. And this one is the color yellow. And you know what I like to do when I have three items. Yeah! Juggle! Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Whee! This is so cool! <laughs> yeah! 
Yeah! I love juggling. Hey, speaking of juggling, maybe I could take these rings and juggle the rings. <laughs> First, what color are these rings? Yeah, a green circle. An orange circle. A red circle. A yellow circle. And a blue circle. All right. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> That's awesome! All right, let's take three of them. This is gonna be a little bit trickier. Here we go! Woo! How'd I do? <laughs> Whoa! Hey! Yeah! A giant circle! Whoa! Do you know what this is? <laughs> yeah! This! is a hula hoop. Whoa! Whoa, check it out! Whoa! Yeah! Woo! Woo! <laughs> oh, and watch this trick. When you spin it backwards, then it'll come back to you. Ready? Whoa. Ready? Max is riding a unicycle. Whoa, that is so cool. Yeah, it kind of looks like a bicycle. Yeah, but bi means two. Yeah, two wheels and tires. But unicycle, una means one. Check it out. Whoa, all of these unicycles have one wheel and tire. Whoa! That one, this one, look at this! This frame is the color yellow! Whoa! Wow! Whoa! Look at how small this is! Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> they are so hard to ride! Whoa! This one is so tall! Whoa! How do you even get up on this? <laughs> I don't even know! Whoa! <laughs> okay, maybe I should find one that fits me. How about this one? This one looks perfect. All right, let me try and ride this unicycle. Okay, do you see how I have these bars next to me? It's so then I can hold on. And when I'm learning, I can learn this way and it'll help me balance. Whoa, whoa. Yeah, I definitely couldn't do this without holding on to these bars. Yeah, unicycles are actually harder to ride than bicycles in my, my opinion. Whoa, whoa, <laughs> whoa. Yeah, it's probably because on a bicycle, you don't have to balance forward and backward. You just have to balance side to side, but in unicycle, whoa, whoa, you have to balance forward and backward, whoa. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna try it with no hands. Whoa, whoa, <laughs> whoa, I almost fell. Let me try it again. Okay. Here I go. Whoa! 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 That was awesome! <laughs> hey, come on in here! Wow! Look at this place! This is the fly room! Whoa! Check it out! 
See all this? This is their trapeze setup. It is so cool. Trapeze is awesome. It's when people climb really high up in the air and then they swing while holding onto a bar. Sometimes they just fall down to the net and sometimes they grab onto other people. Hey, speaking of the net, check it out. Whoa! That looks like a really soft landing. <laughs> hey, come on! Wow! Hey, who are you? Hi, I'm Caitlin. Oh, nice to meet you, Caitlin. Hey, Caitlin does the trapeze here, and she is really good. Will you show us some trapeze? Definitely. <laughs> yeah. training with you. Did you have fun? Yeah, I did too. Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? B-L-I-P-P-I. Flippy. Good job. <laughs> wow, this has been so much fun. Woohoo! Yeah! So much to learn about, it'll make you want to shout, Flippy! <laughs> hey, it's me, Flippy! And today we're here at Great Explorations Children's Museum in St. Petersburg, Florida. <laughs> yeah! And I can't wait to see what's inside and start playing. Whoa! Come on! <laughs> Whoa! Look where we're at! The Sandy Shack! <laughs> yeah! It's a really big sandbox, and you and I get to go inside! <laughs> but first, we gotta take off our shoes. One, two! <laughs> okay, I'll put these to the side, and we can go inside! Don't forget your bucket! Whoa! Look at it! Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> it's so cool in here! It's really sandy! There's so much sand here, and it's a good thing we have our pail and shovels. Yeah, we have two blue shovels. We can pick up sand. And we have one, two, three different pails. Yeah, this one is the color yellow. This one is the color orange. And this one is the color red. <laughs> yeah, these are really helpful for scooping sand up, whoa, and making a sand castle. Okay, let's try it out. <laughs> Uh-oh, it looked like our sand castle didn't stand up, but that's okay. Sometimes when you're trying to make something, it doesn't work on the first time, so you gotta just keep trying. <laughs> whoa, this is pretty cool. Whoa, but do you see these animals? Whoa, do you know what kind of animal this is? It's kind of hiding in the sand. <laughs> Yeah, this animal is a crab. <laughs> He's feeling a little crabby. <laughs> so silly. Well, this crab is really cool. Hey, do you know how crabs like to move? Uh-huh. Yeah, they don't like to walk like us. They like to go side to side. Hey, will you act like a crab with me? <laughs> yeah. Okay, here we go. Let's do a crab walk. <laughs> Moving side to side like a crab is so much fun! <laughs> yeah! But look at this! There's another animal! Whoa! This animal is really big and likes to live on beaches just like a crab in the sand. This, yeah, this guy, he's a sea turtle. Whoa! And look how big his shell is! Whoa! It's bigger than my head! <laughs> Whoa! This is so much fun playing in the sand 
Woo, woo, woo. <laughs> Maybe we can make a sand angel. Okay, here we go. Whoa, <laughs> that was so much fun playing in the sand with you. <laughs> Gotta dust myself off because I'm pretty sandy now. <laughs> Let's go keep exploring. But first, we gotta put our shoes on. Now that we have our shoes on, all we have to do is tie them. Yeah, do you know how to tie your shoes? Yeah, they can be really, really hard tying your shoes. But this is how I like to tie them. So I take my laces, and first I cross them over, and I take one of the laces, and I put it through the center. Yeah, like that. And I pull it tight. Once I've done the first step, then I take the laces and I make cute little bunny ears. Yeah, just like this. You see my two little bunny ears? Hop, 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 hop. <laughs> it's so cute. Yeah. And then I take the bunny ears and they give each other a little hug. They wrap around and I pull that tight too. Okay, this time I'll do it a little faster. Okay, we take our laces, we cross them, and then one lace goes under. Then, one bunny ear, two bunny ears. Woo! <laughs> and we cross them. We then wrap that one through to give it a little hug. And we pull it tight. Whoa! Look at that! We tied our shoes. And sometimes I like to do it again to double knot my shoes because I like to dance and I like to run and play. And you don't want to play or dance when your shoes are untied, because then you might trip on your shoelace. That wouldn't be very fun. <laughs> well, there's so much more to explore. Come on! There are so many cool things here. <laughs> Look at this really big circle. Hello! Woo! Woo! <laughs> Whoa! And look at this over here. There are so many cubes. <laughs> Whoa! There are so many different colors on these cubes. Look, we have the color white and the color red. And the color purple and the color blue. <gasps> Wait a minute. If I turn it this way, my two favorite colors, blue and orange. Hey, look over here. There's like a little diorama playset. And there's all kinds of cool animals, like a little piggy. Oink, 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 oink. <laughs> Woo, he's gonna walk on the bridge. Woo, and look, there are two sheep. Yeah, one, two. And you know what sound sheep make? Yeah, they go like this. Bah, bah. <laughs> and they're also gonna be on the bridge. Because they're friends with Mr. Piggy. Okay, right there. Whoa, and look at this. There are three animals here. One, two, three. Do you know what kind of animals these are? Yeah, they're little lambs. And they're so cute and tiny. Ooh. <laughs> they're gonna hang out near the bridge too. Whoa, and look at this. There are four really big cows. Moo, moo, moo. <laughs> yeah. One, two, three, four. Whoa, four really big cows. <laughs> and they're gonna go, they're gonna go in the water. They're taking a little bath, because it's really warm out. <laughs> Ooh, woo, <laughs> woo. Hello, Mr. Pig. Hello, Mr. Cow. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> so silly. That was really fun, playing with all those foam cubes and seeing about those animals. Hey, look over here. Whoa. And look at this. Have you ever seen one of these before? Yeah, this is called an abacus. Mm -hmm. And it's really good at helping do math or arithmetic. Mm -hmm. Look, you can do it like this. One yellow lemon plus one yellow lemon. Hmm, how many lemons does that make? Yeah, two lemons. Okay, that was pretty easy. But now you can do an even harder one. What about Two apples plus three apples. Whoa, that's a lot harder. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five. Whoa, two plus three apples 
There's five apples! Whoa! Yeah, Abacus is really helpful for counting and math. These are really, really big. There's a watermelon and a pumpkin. <laughs> and the pumpkin's my favorite color, orange. Hmm, I wonder what these are. Whoa! This isn't a watermelon, it's a watermelon drum. Well, that means that the pumpkin's a drum too. Whoa, <laughs> they sounded really cool. Whoa. Those are awesome fruit drums, <laughs> yeah. Whoa, look at this over here. Whoa, look at all these different fruits and vegetables, yeah. We have lettuce, onion, corn, potato, carrot, whoa, and tomato. Those are so many different kinds. Now, what we can do is play a really fun game where we take all the foods in this basket and we have to match them to the right word. So first, we got some onions. So let's see, one onion, two onion. <laughs> Got it, that was pretty easy. Next, we got two red tomatoes. Ooh, hmm, where should the red tomatoes go? Here? Hmm, here? <laughs> yeah, that's right, we'll put them right over here. Okay, here we go, one, two. Okay, we got a couple more. Whoa, what about this? Wow, there's a lot of things here. Wait a minute, where should we put this lettuce? It says lettuce here, but there are four parts and only two holes. Wait a minute, these are halves. So if you take one half and another half, and you put them together, you get one whole. One whole head of lettuce. <laughs> and we have two over here, so one half and one half, one half and one half, two whole heads of lettuce. We'll put them in the holes. One, two. <laughs> and we have two heads of corn, Whoa, look at this. We have some yummy carrots. <laughs> I love carrots, and so do a lot of animals, like rabbits and horses. <laughs> woo, woo, <laughs> it looks like I have bunny ears with my carrots. Woo, 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 <laughs> that's so fun. Okay, we'll put two carrots, one carrot, and two carrots. Hmm, what's left? <gasps> oh yeah, a potato! Whoa, look. We got one potato right here, and we have another potato right, wait a minute, is this a potato? <laughs> that's not a potato, that's a donut, so silly. <laughs> well, I guess we'll put it in the potato because we only have one potato, but this, not a potato. <laughs> Whoa, we did a really good job matching all the fruit together. Well, wow, there's so much more to explore, come on. I just came out of this really awesome treehouse. Hey, let's explore it a little. Whoa, look at it. This is so big. This tree is enormous. Yeah, look, it's so big that they built a house under the tree, in the tree, and a house above the tree. Whoa, this is such a cool treehouse. I think you and I should go up in it. Come on. Look at this place, it's so amazing. And look at this, this isn't any tree house. This is Longo's Cove. And look at this, this is a pirate ship. Whoa, someone put this big pirate ship up in the tree. Hello pirates. <laughs> Whoa, I'm so excited, let's climb up. But I have a really good idea. How about you and I count all the steps on our way up? <laughs> Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There's some more over here. Eight, nine, ten, eleven. Whoa, twelve. We made it up all the stairs. And it was twelve. That was a lot. Whoa, check this out. You know what this is right here? Yeah, 
This is called a spyglass, and this will help us see really far away. Whoa, I can see so far from here. <laughs> and hey, look at this. Can you find these birds? Yeah, there's all different birds over on the wall and hiding in all different places. And we can use the spyglass to see if we can find them. Okay, we want to find an osprey, a roseate spoonbill, a brown pelican, blue herons, sandwich terns, and anhingas. Ooh, that sounds like a really cool bird. Let's see if we can find them. Okay, I'm looking. Whoa, I think I found the anhinga. He's right over there. Whoa, and I see a blue heron. <laughs> hey, right up against the blue wall. And, yeah, look, there's the sandwich tern. Whoa, that was amazing. Looking for all those different birds. Hey, do you know where all those birds like to live? <laughs> yeah, they live in a place called an estuary. Whoa, estuary is a really fancy word, but it basically means where the ocean meets a river. Woo, <laughs> yeah. Hey, I have a fun game. Do you think that an estuary has salty water or fresh water without any salt? Hmm. <laughs> yeah, you're all right, because it's both salty and fresh. It's kind of, kind of salty. <laughs> yeah, and we call that brackish water. Whoa, that's another big word. <laughs> but it's amazing, because all these cool birds and some really cool fish like to live there. <laughs> yeah. Whoa, this treehouse is pretty amazing. Let's see what else we can find. <laughs> Whoa, look at this place. Do you see above me? Whoa, it's a captain's wheel. Whoa, I bet this came from the pirate ship. Whoa, that is so cool. I wish we could ride a real pirate ship into the ocean. Whoa, hey. It looks like there's a lot of types of trash in this treehouse. Huh, yeah, and it says over here, don't pollute. Mm -hmm. Have you ever heard of recycling? Yeah, it's really good because recycling helps to take care of the animals that live in the ocean and on land. <laughs> yeah, if you ever have trash, make sure it goes in the recycling bin or a trash can and not in the water. Mm -mm. <laughs> Well, this treehouse is pretty cool, but I'm gonna see if I can go climb up to the top. I'll see you soon. Whoa! That was so much fun, <laughs> but I'm a little bit dizzy. <laughs> Whoa, hey, I have a really fun idea. How about you and I go up to the pirate ship in Longo's Cove and ride the big yellow slide? <laughs> yeah, come on, let's go. Whoa, <laughs> it looks like we've been here before. Okay, we went that way, so now let's go this way. <laughs> This is so cool. Look at this place. <laughs> this treehouse is kind of spooky. Ooh. <laughs> well, I had so much fun with you today exploring the Sandy Shack and Longo's Cove. <laughs> it was so much fun. And now for the very best part, we go down the big yellow slide. Okay, I think I'm ready. On your mark, get set, and go, Blippi. Bye-bye! Whoa! Whoa! That was so much fun! <laughs> wow, I had a really great time playing with you today here at Great Explorations Children's Museum in St. Petersburg, Florida. And we had a really fun time playing in the sand in the Sandy Shack 
and climbing all the way to the top of Longo's Cove. Whoa! <laughs> well, that's the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Hey, can you spell my name with me? <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I, Blippi. Good job. Well, I'll see you real soon. Bye-bye. Woo! <laughs>
Here we go. Whoa! That horn was really loud. <laughs> Let's see what else there is. Whoa! Look at this. It's a rescue boat. This rescue boat is on some really rocky waves. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> it's so much fun. And it's squishy. Whoa! The waves are going so fast and they're so huge! Whoa! <laughs> Woo! Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> the water is nice and cool. Yeah. Because it's made out of a ball pit. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> This is so amazing. I really am having so much fun playing with you today. Hey, and look at this. It looks kind of like a really big picture frame. Yeah, it's a big square. Hmm. And it has some pulleys and a steering wheel. When I move this steering wheel, whoa. It moves up and it makes bubbles. <laughs> Let's see, we can make the biggest bubble with this giant bubble blower. <laughs> Whoa, <laughs> we did it. That was an amazing bubble, but it popped because that's what bubbles do. They get really big, and then pop, <laughs> they pop. <laughs> this is so cool. It looks like mountains and oceans. And there's a little shark. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> this shark is having a really fun time going through the ocean. It's so fast. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> it did a big jump! Whoa! Whoa! And look at this! This is really cool! It's a submarine! <laughs> yeah! And it has its propeller that helps it move really fast underwater. And it looks like it has a scuba diver driving it. <laughs> Whoa! I think it's gonna swim with the shark too. <laughs> Look at this. See, when I press this big button, something really amazing and really wet is going to happen. Are you ready? Keep your eye over here and your eye over here. Here we go. I'm gonna press the button on the count of three. One, two, three. <laughs> Did you see it? Now let's press them really fast. Uh-oh, looks like they don't like to be pressed really fast. There are so many cool things to explore with water. There's so many boats. Whoa, look at all of the boats. <laughs> There's so many. Yeah, we have one, two green boats, and we have one, two, purple boats. And we have, well, we have one, two, three orange boats. <laughs> These are so cool. And if you have an orange boat and a blue boat, you have blippy boats. Woo! <laughs> this is so cool. There's all these different water wheels and water. <laughs> Whoa. And looks like we can take this little island and move it all around. <laughs> Bye-bye, octopus. Hey, do you know what kind of animal this is? <laughs> yeah, this right here is a sea turtle. And it's so cute. <laughs> Whoa. Hey, look. I think I can get on the inside. 
Hello! Whoa! There's water all around me! <laughs> Woo! This is a really silly crab. There are so many animals. Whoa, but I think there's a really cool wall that we should go explore. <laughs> Let's go see what it is. Look at it. This is a magnetic wall. Yeah, it's a giant wall that's magnetic, which means squares like this and have little magnets will stick to the wall. So if you take the square and you put it on the wall, no hands, whoa! <laughs> and sometimes the magnets are so strong, you can throw it and it stays by itself. Whoa! And you can make all kinds of cool shapes and pictures. Hmm, so let's see if we can make a picture. Move some of these out of the way. Start with a really big orange square. And we'll put it right there. And next, let's grab two more orange squares. What color should I use next? Hmm, we already used orange, so let's use blue. <laughs> okay, now we're gonna go with one, two blue triangles. And let's grab two blue squares. And hmm, we're almost done, but I think we should make two. Hmm, let's use an orange and we'll use a blue one too. <laughs> yeah, it's a blippy magnetic castle. King Blippy. <laughs> so silly. <laughs> Whoa, and do you know what this is? Yeah, look at it. This right here, yeah, it's a gear. Whoa, <laughs> look at it go. Yeah, and when you take a gear and you put one gear next to another gear, when you turn this one, the other gear will turn too. Now, the really fun part. When you take one gear connected to another gear, you have two gears moving. But if you connect those two gears to the, all the gears, then they all move together. <laughs> Teamwork is really fun, especially if you're a gear. Whoa. <laughs> Are you ready? Let's use a lot of teamwork with the gears. <laughs> Whoa, look at it go! <laughs> They're all moving together, but I'm only touching this one right here. See? They're moving and helping each other out. Whoa, super fast! <laughs> this is so much fun! This place is amazing! And look above us! It looks like there's a tunnel in the ceiling! <laughs> I have had so much fun, but I think you and I should go up into the tunnel. Yeah. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Whoa, it's really tricky moving through these nets. <laughs> hey, I think it looks like there's a window over by the water area. Hey, look, it's a window, <laughs> hello. And it looks like the water area is a giant spinner. <laughs> Whoa, that's so silly. Huh, yeah, it's so cool because when we were down there, it just looked like some islands and some oceans and some water, but because we have a different perspective. Yeah, a different perspective. That means a different way of seeing it or a different way of looking at it. Yeah, we see with our different perspective that it actually is a giant spinner. <laughs> Whoa, this is so cool.
It's so wobbly. <laughs> wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. <laughs> so silly. Wow. We crossed over the yellow bridge. And now we're all the way on the other side. Okay. This is so cool. It's a giant purple triangle. <laughs> yeah, because look, the triangle has three sides. One, two, three. <laughs> oh, look over here. Hello, I'm Blippi. What's your name? Oh, hi there, Blippi. Uh, my name is the amazing Andres. Ooh, nice to meet you, Andres. <laughs> Whoa, are you juggling? Oh yeah, I am juggling all right. Oh, Andres is really good at juggling. <laughs> <laughs> You're too kind, Flippy. But you know, it's actually not that hard to juggle three balls. It just takes a lot of practice. Ooh, you know, practice. <laughs> great things start off with one ball, okay. like so. See, catching it good. And then, when I'm ready, I'll go two. Huh. And then, when I feel really good, I'll throw in a third ball. Whoa. There we go. <laughs> that is amazing. <laughs> well, Andres, that is so cool. But what else do you do here? Oh, I do all kinds of fun stuff. I get to spend most of my time coming up with really cool ways for people to have fun here at this museum. <laughs> well, that's really good because we want to have lots of fun too. <laughs> well, is there anything fun that we could do? You know, I got something perfect for you. Ooh. You like to make art? Yeah, I love making art. Hey, maybe we could make an art project. <laughs> I'm so excited. <laughs> got just the thing. Come over here. We'll go to the art crawl room. Okay. You're going to want to step in here first. Thank you, Andres. All right. All right. Here we go. Look at where I am. We're inside of an art studio. Whoa, this place is so cool. And look at all the things that are here. We have all kinds of different paint where we can paint really beautiful pictures and make really cool artwork. Hmm. We have some pink paint and a lot of colors actually. Some black paint. Ooh. <laughs> And we have some green, Ooh. and it's got some confetti in it, whoa. <laughs> and it looks like we have a lot of other colors. Hmm. We have, oh, this paint is gold, and it's really shiny. <laughs> Maybe we can think of something really beautiful to paint with this gold paint. Hmm. But first, we need something to use as a paintbrush. Hmm. Oh, hey, look, <laughs> I have a brush and some paint, and oh, we just need to think about what should we paint? Well, you can start with something really easy. Maybe make a gold smiley face. <laughs> One eye, two eyes, and a really big smile. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> He's so happy! Since we can paint all over this room, let's see how much we can cover and paint! Okay, I'm gonna paint all over the room. It's gonna be so fun! Okay, I think I'm gonna need two rollers and a lot of paint. Let's go! <laughs> Okay, now let's do it with some pink paint. Okay. Painting is so fun. <laughs> Especially when you can paint all over the place. <laughs> and get a little messy. But just make sure when you're painting, it's paper you're painting on and not the actual walls. <laughs> yeah, I like to paint on the paper, but not on the actual wall. <laughs> This was so much fun painting with you. <laughs> hey, that was.
was so much fun playing with you here at the Caton Children's Museum in Santa Monica, California. <laughs> well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Hey, can you spell my name with me? Okay, here we go. B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Blippi. Good job. Well, I'll see you real soon. Bye-bye. me Blippi. Today we're gonna learn about some construction vehicles. They are so big and powerful. Can you guess which construction vehicle this is? Let's go find out. Hey, it's me Blippi and look at where I'm at. Yeah, today I'm in Tenino, Washington at a ranch. Yeah, check it out. All this beautiful grass. Wow. Hey, but today we're gonna explore a machine. Let me give you some hints on what machine this is. So, it's a machine that you can use in this big open field. Yeah, for crops, yeah. It starts with the letter T. You can have a lot of attachments on it. <laughs> Do you know what it is? <laughs> yeah, let's go. Whoa, check it out. This is a tractor. Whoa, tractors are so cool. Typically, you use them on farms and ranches. They get so much work done. Hey, check it out. Whoa, do you see this? This is a big bucket, and it can scoop a lot of dirt and gravel and things like that. Whoa. Wow. These are the bucket arms, which help lift the bucket. Whoa. Right here. These are the hydraulic hoses, which help tilt and scoop things up and lift up the bucket. Oh, and you know what this is. Yeah, this is where you fill up the tractor with fuel. And this tractor doesn't take gas, it takes diesel. <laughs> yeah. Whoa, that right there is the cab. Here, go on to the other side, let's go. Whoa! Hey, this tractor, yeah, has one big wheel and tire. Yeah! Whoa, look at this over here. Whew. Now this is a big wheel and tire. Hey, did you notice? It has one wheel and tire, two wheel and tires, and the other side have two more. So that means Two plus two equals four. Yeah, good job. Wow, check out the back of the tractor. Yeah, this is a mower attachment. Wow, on the back right here, there's some blades and this attaches to the tractor. And this is what you use to go across grass like this, chop it down, and then you have a nice yard to play in. <laughs> but hey, tractors have a lot of attachments they can have, like augers, or balers, or hay fluffers. Whoa, that is awesome. Hey, now I think we should head inside and drive the tractor. Yeah, let's go. Yeah, we're inside the cab of the tractor. Okay, first things first. Yeah, safety first. Yep, that means we have to wear our seat belt. Perfect. All right, there we go. Now that we're all buckled up, we can take the key and put it in the ignition and start it up. But for now, let me show you all the things in here. Yeah, down here, these are the brakes of the tractor. Yeah, those are what you put your feet on so then you stop the tractor in its tracks or tires. <laughs> yeah, and this right here, this is the steering wheel. This is how you operate and drive the tractor. <laughs> yeah. And this handle right here, 
You pull back to lift up the bucket. You push forward to put the bucket down. And left and right is to dump out the dirt. <laughs> I think we should go get the dirt. All right, let's turn it on and test out the horn. <laughs> All right, here we go. She's purring like a kitty. Meow. <laughs> This tractor is so useful. Good job! <laughs> Whoa! Isn't that a cool machine? Yeah, it was so fun operating and driving that tractor. Wow, what a useful machine that you can use on farms and ranches. Whoa, so cool. So many attachments and so many uses. Yeah, we learned about a tractor. Construction vehicles are awesome. Can you guess what this construction vehicle is? It has huge wheels. Let's go find out. Wow, check out this machine. Do you know what machine this is? Yeah, it looks kind of like a truck, but it has a giant bed or a box right here, which has a lot of material in the back and it dumps it out. Wait a second. That must mean it's a dump truck. Yeah, dump trucks are awesome. Whoa, look up here. So big. Wow, this is where the engine is. Wow, that's a big engine. You need a massive engine because you need a lot of power to lift up the box. Whoa, check these out. Yeah, you know what these are. Yeah, these are wheels and tires. Whoa, this vehicle is really cool because in the back, there's a lot of them. I'll show you that now. But first, we need to check out the cab. Whoa, this is where the operator sits. Whoa, check it out. Whoa, there's a lot of things in there just like a normal vehicle. A steering wheel, some, yeah, some lights. There's also a mirror, there's a key to start it, yeah, and a bunch of gauges and gadgets, so then you can operate it. Whoa! But this machine needs a lot of fuel to run. Yeah, I called it fuel because it's not gas, it's diesel. Whoa! Whoa! Look! Yeah. Do you see how many wheels and tires this vehicle has? Look, there's two right here. <laughs> Normally, they only have one in the front and one in the back. But this has two in the back. Yeah, and that is multiplied by two because it's on each side. So that means on one side, there is one, two, three. Yeah, and you can add three on this side to the other side. Three plus three, yeah, is six. Whoa, these are called mud flaps. Woohoo! Because they flap. Uh, 
like a dog's ear. Woohoo! Actually, what it's used for is so then mud doesn't fling out to the vehicles trailing it. Yeah, and look at this. This is the tailgate of the dump truck. When you lift up the load, then it dumps it all out. And I think that's what we should do now. <laughs> Awesome. is loading up the dump truck. Wow, what great teamwork. Whoa, those are some big scoops that us excavator is putting in that dump truck. Whoa, wow. It looks nice and full. I sure do love dump trucks. They're so tall, so powerful, and so useful on the job site. Well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? B-L-I-P-P-I, -I, Flippy. Good job. All right, see you later. Bye-bye. It's me, Blippi! And today, we're exploring construction vehicles. Let's see, can you guess which vehicle this is? Let's go find out! Hey, it's me, Blippi! Wow, and look at where I'm at! Yeah, today, I'm at Tenino, Washington at a job site. Yeah, and today, you and I get to learn about a machine. Yeah, a really heavy machine. It has a really big blade up front pushes anything and everything out of its way. It has a lot of power. It's a little slow though. And it starts with the letter B, just like my name. <laughs> Do you know what machine it is? Okay, let's go find out. Woohoo! <laughs> Check it out! Wow! A piece of construction equipment! And this is a powerful piece of construction equipment. 
Do you know what machine this is? Yeah! This is a bulldozer! Whoa, it is so powerful. Here, come on! Whoa! This is the blade of the bulldozer. Yeah, the blade pushes anything and everything out of its way. And then it goes flat on the ground and then makes the ground nice and flat. Whoa! Whoa! And how it gets all of its power is right here. Yeah, the engine. And this is the engine compartment. Yeah, it produces a lot of power and a lot of smoke out of the exhaust. Wow, super cool. Hey, do you see these? Huh, this is silly. <laughs> yeah, there's no wheels and tires. That's silly, huh? Oh, these are called tracks. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, these metal things go down into the dirt, the gravel, the mud, so then it has really good traction, so then it doesn't slip and slide. <laughs> All right, I think I should take it for a spin. Woohoo! Whoa, so comfortable. All right, first things first, safety first. Perfect. Now that I'm nice and safe with my seatbelt, we can operate the bulldozer. Yeah. You operate a bulldozer. You do not drive a bulldozer. <laughs> okay, see these hand controls? This is how you operate the bulldozer. This one makes you go forward and backward. And this one, yeah. This is what you use to control the blade. <laughs> All right, here we go. Let's turn on the key. Woohoo! All right, flip up the safety doodads and here. We go. Whoa, check it out. Whoa. Woohoo. All right. was fun. <laughs> that was awesome. Wow, what a powerful machine. Did you see that big blade up front? Yeah, it's so good and powerful. It pushes anything and everything out of its way. Our first vehicle was a bulldozer. They are such an important piece of equipment and help clear the way. Hmm, can you guess what this next vehicle is? Let's go check it out. Let me give you some hints on what piece of machinery we're gonna learn about. Okay, it's a machine that loves to dig. Yeah, it typically has tracks. Yeah, has an arm and a boom and a bucket. Digs big holes and it starts with the letter E. <laughs> Can you guess it? Okay, here we go.
this excavator? Yeah, I was driving and holding this giant log. Wait, did you hear that? Yeah, an excavator. Wow, what a cool machine. This is actually a mini excavator. Yeah, they have small ones like this, and they have big ones like that. Wow. Hey, did you see I was sitting in the seat? Yeah, this is the cab of the excavator. Wow, there's so many controls in there. Oh, so cool. Hey, and look down here. Wow. Yeah, just like a bulldozer, this excavator has tracks. But a bulldozer's tracks are metal. And these, yeah, they're rubber, like tires. Wow, that is really cool. The cab can swing around. Yeah, did you see me swing around? Whoa, so cool. Oh, and up here, wow. It's hard to see because the bucket is right here. But this is the blade. Just like a bulldozer, this excavator has a blade to flatten things out and push things out of its way. And where this log is sitting, yeah, this is the bucket of the excavator. Wow, this bucket has some big teeth. Yeah, <laughs> whoa. Wow, and look at this. This kind of looks like a big tooth, but this is actually called a thumb. Wow, the thumb is used to grab things, just like this log. Whoa, and all this, this is the arm and the boom, which then can lift up, swing around, and use the bucket to dig. Yeah, I think I should hop on in and do some digging. Woohoo! I'm an excavator, excavator, hey dirt, see you later, I'm an excavator, I've got a great big arm and a great big boom, if I start digging now I'll be done real soon, I'm a dirt separator, I'm an excavator. fun to play around in, and it's the per perfect home for some plants. Woohoo! Here we go. Here you go, plants. Woohoo! <laughs> wow, excavators are awesome. Yeah! Wasn't that excavator so cool? I love getting to dig things up, and an excavator makes it so easy and fun. That sure was fun learning about that excavator today, wasn't it? Yeah! You can dig some massive holes with the excavator. And since it doesn't have wheels and tires, it has tracks. Yeah, you never get stuck. Yeah! Well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? B-L-I-P-P-I, -P -P -I, Blippi! 
Good job. See you again. Bye-bye. Hello, it's me, Blippi. Today, we're in Tenino, Washington, in front of a greenhouse. Whoa, do you know what a greenhouse is? Yeah, a greenhouse is a house that houses plants. Yeah, it controls the environment. So then you can make sure that the temperature is just right for the plants to grow really big. <laughs> Let's go inside and check it out, come on. This place is awesome. There are so many plants here. Wow. Hey, look at this one. Yeah, it's a flower. Oh. Ah, oh, smells so good. Looks so pretty. <laughs> yeah. Check it out. Another one. Yeah. What color is this flower? Yeah, it's the color pink. Ooh, and all these leaves. What color are they? Yeah, the color green. Wow, flowers are so cool. You can put them on your tabletop and they look so pretty. Whoa, what kind of plants are these? Oh, they look real small compared to those flowers. Yeah, these are actually called succulents. Huh, interesting. They kind of look like cactuses. Yeah, but they're not pokey or anything. Actually, a cactus? Yeah, that's a type of succulent. Wow, succulents are so cool. Whoa! Ooh, some more flowers over here. Wow, there's so many flowers. A lot of greenhouses have flowers in them, or they could be growing fruits. Hmm, <laughs> I love fruits. And they might grow vegetables. Yum! I love vegetables too. I really enjoy eating healthy. Do you eat healthy? Yeah, good job. But hey, what color is this flower? Yeah, it's the color purple. Come on. It's not a fruit, it's not a vegetable. These look like a type of grass. Yeah, three different types of grasses. Look, whoa, looks like my hair. Hello, hey, <laughs> do I look silly or do I look silly? <laughs> oh, now that is silly. <laughs> Here's another type right here. Whoa, and another type. Whoa! Yeah, do you have grass at your house? You very well might. It's so fun to play in and roll in. Whoa, 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 <laughs> wow. <laughs> Ooh, there's so many plants in here. I enjoy greenhouses. Whoa, look at this. Wow, whoa, a big pot of Flowers. Did you see how it was hanging? Yeah, this looks like a nice, pretty bouquet of flowers. Yeah, a bouquet is where it's a big group of flowers, but typically you cut them off and then you can make a very colorful bouquet. Wow, so pretty. But this is also pretty and it's in a hanging pot. Wow, all right. We have to make sure we put things back where we found them, woohoo! Whoa, check these out. Wow, so many colors. What colors do you see right here? Looks like that one is pink. That one right there is red. Ooh, look at that one. It's the same color as the sun. Yeah, yellow. <laughs> Whoa. All right, I have a really fun thing for us to do together. Have you ever planted a plant? 
Yeah, it's so much fun. Do you see this? Yeah, you know what this is? It's a flower. It's an adult flower. It's really old. <laughs> and look at this one. This looks like a teenager or a baby. It hasn't even created the flower yet, but soon enough, this is going to turn into this. But in order for it to become this size, yeah, it starts out as a seed. Yeah, every single plant, like flowers, I should say, start out as seeds. All right, but the things that every plant needs are sun, water, soil, which is like a house, and nutrition, which is like food. Whoa, all right, so let's create this plant's house or home where we're gonna put the seed. Oh, there we go. Yeah, let's scoop up this soil. Oh, <laughs> I'm making a mess, that's okay. <laughs> I'll clean it up after. There we go, all right. This soil has a lot of nutrition already in it. Yeah, there we go. And sometimes the water that you put in this to water it has some nutrition in it as well. All right, so check this out. This right here is a flower seed. Wow, do you see how small it is? Yeah, so cool. So when you put this right in here and you push it down, there we go. Okay, let's cover it up just a little bit. The soil is nice and moist. And then after a while, it's gonna sprout up. And it's gonna be so small and cute. Oh! <laughs> and then it'll grow up to be this. Wow, so green and pretty. <laughs> but when it becomes an adult, it is going to flower. Yeah, good job. All right, so what are the four things that every plant needs to grow? Yeah, it needs some sun. It needs some soil. It needs some nutrition. And it needs some water. Wow. This was awesome. <laughs> Walking through the forest, look at all the trees. They give us lots of air, what we need to breathe. Look at all the critters roaming on the ground. They help carry the seeds to grow plants all around. Flowers are a-blooming, making lots of food for all the bugs and creatures. Even me and you We're singing the earth song We're helping the planet Together, together We can make a change We're singing the earth song Recycle paper, glass, and plastic Taking care of the earth Will make you feel fantastic You can plant a tree Or pick up some trash Ask a friend for help Then it'll be a blast We're singing the earth song We're helping the planet Together, together We can make a change
fun learning about plants with you. Well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Flippy. Good job. All right. See you again. Bye-bye. <laughs> so much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout. Flippy. It's me, Blippi. I just finished writing a lot of invitations for a party next week. <laughs> I'm so excited. And I'm excited because I'm going to make a really yummy dinner. <laughs> Can you guess what I'm going to make for dinner? I'll give you a hint. Hmm. It has a lot of toppings and can be made really big so a lot of people can share it. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, that's right. I'm going to have a pizza party! <laughs> and I know the perfect place that we can learn how to make pizza. Oleo pizza. <laughs> Come on! This is going to be so much fun! I'll see you there! Hey! It's me, Flippy! And today we're here in our real life pizza kitchen! Yeah! So we're gonna learn how to make pizza. Oh, I'm so excited! But first things first, we got to put on our gloves. So here we go. One. And we'll put on another one. <laughs> here we go. Great. We got our gloves on and we're all ready to make some pizza. Oh, hey, hey uh, what's your name? Hey, my name is Michael. Uh, hi, Michael. Uh, can you teach us how to make some pizza today? Yes, no problem. I want to teach how to make the pizza. Oh, okay. Okay, the first thing you need to take the spatula. Okay. Flour. Okay. And this is the dough, okay? Oh, yeah. Okay, you need to put a, a little bit of flour in the top. You take it out the dough, and you put again in the flour, okay? Okay. After that, you need to split a little bit of flour in the, in the floor. You push a little bit, you take it out the, the air. Oh, After okay. that, you need to shape a little bit. Push it. Nice. And you start shaping. Ooh, it's so stretchy and stringy. <laughs> yeah. Shape it, shape it, shape it. And when it's almost done, you need to put again right here. Whoa! You're really good at making pizza, Michael. Yeah. After that, you need to put tomato sauce. <gasps> oh! This is sauce. Whoa! Look at that. With a spoon. <laughs> put the shape right here. Okay. Whoa! After that, you need to put the cheese. Okay, cheese. This is a parmesan cheese. Parmesan cheese is so good, yes. And this is a mozzarella cheese. Mmm, yummy. Oh. So and then fresh basil. Oh, fresh basil. <gasps> you cut Ooh, it so yummy. And the small oh. pieces. <laughs> Make it nice. And uh Cheddar heirloom tomatoes. Ooh, tomatoes! Mm. After that, you need to put like olive oil. Okay. <gasps> and that's the pizza ready for the oven. Oh, yeah! That pizza looks so yummy! <gasps> this pizza goes to the oven, okay? Yeah! <laughs> now, you wanna make pizza? yeah, can I make okay, a pizza no too? Okay. Here Here's we go. The flour. Take the flour. Put the flour on the top. Whoa! Take it. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Nice. We put in the flour. We'll put it in the yeah. flour. Play with the dough. <laughs> kind of sticky. Here we go. And we're gonna take it out again. Take it out. We should take it out the, the air. Yeah. Okay. We'll push all the air out and the bubbles out of the pizza dough. Whoa! Whoa! It's so stringy. Whoa! <laughs> so silly. Okay. Here we go. Keep pushing out all those bubbles. Mm -hmm. Okay, here we go. Keep doing it. Do it, do it Keep pushing it. it out. A little bit, yeah. Mm. You can flip a little bit. Yeah. Nice. Here we go. Whoa! It's starting to look just like a pizza. Whoa! This is a lot harder than it looks. <laughs> here we go. Whoa. A little bit more. <laughs> you are really good at this. <laughs> Whoa. You can put tomato sauce inside. Yeah. You can put Whoa. tomato sauce. Look at this. This is really yummy tomato sauce. Whoa. <laughs> okay, 
Now, let's put the tomato sauce on the pizza. Here we go. Whoop. And then we're gonna mix it around. Okay. Parmesan cheese. Nice. And now we have our Parmesan cheese. So yummy. Ooh. Put a little on there. And the mozzarella cheese. And we got some mozzarella. Oh, whoa. This cheese is really cool because it's in all kinds of shapes. Do you know what kind of shape this mozzarella cheese is? <laughs> yeah, that's right. It's a triangle. Okay, so I'll put some of those little triangles and squares. Hmm, put some more squares. More squares. <laughs> Whoa, right, okay. After that, you need to put the basil a little bit. From some basil. Fresh basil. Fresh basil, yummy. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa, that's a lot of basil. <laughs> yeah, olive oil on the top. And a little bit of olive oil, here we go. Whoa! <laughs> so silly. And that's the margarita bit, so you can put the tomatoes too. Okay, we'll put a couple tomatoes that have been chopped in half that are also really yummy. We'll put those on top. <gasps> and now, the pizza is almost ready to go in the oven. <laughs> awesome. That's it. Well, Very Michael. Easy. Thank you so much for teaching me how to make a pizza. <laughs> yeah, and thank you for helping me make some yummy, yummy pizza. <laughs> Good job. Now, let's go put these pizzas into the oven. <laughs> Here we go. Whoa. <gasps> you, need to, you move a little bit, because you sure you're not stuck in the pizza? Uh, you put into the oven. Whoa, it's really hot in this oven. Whoa. <laughs> I can't wait for it to be all done. <laughs> Let's go put the other pizza Let in. Let me put the other one. Yeah. It's the same thing. <laughs> this. <laughs> Make sure the toppings oh. is good. Whoa. Whoa. Look at it. Man. There's a big fire inside this pizza oven. It's really, really hot. And, and it you helps wait to like cook the pizza. You wait like 30 seconds after that, you can flip the pizza, okay? <laughs> Ooh. Well, now all we have to do is wait for the pizza to get done. <laughs> so I'm gonna do a pizza dance. Here we go. <laughs> so silly. <laughs> okay, it looks like the pizza is almost ready. Let's see. Whoa, the pizza almost done, almost done. is almost done. The pizza was really small, but because the dough has flour and yeast, when it gets really hot, the dough begins to rise and it becomes a delicious pizza. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Whoa, that was so much fun learning how to make pizza at Oleo Pizza. It was so delicious. Hey. Did you know that pizza originally came from Italy? <laughs> yeah, and it makes me really want to learn how to speak Italian. So I invited my good friend Francesca over. <laughs> I think that's her. Hello? Hi, Puppy. Hi, Francesca. <laughs> I'm so excited to learn Italian. We just learned how to make pizza. Do you think you could teach us some Italian? Si, certo. Whoa, <laughs> that was Italian. <laughs> and I said, of course. Ooh, I'm so excited to learn. Let's go. <laughs> this is going to be so much fun. So first, maybe we should learn our numbers. Okay, let's count to five together. Okay, here we go. Zero. 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 zero <laughs> uno. Uno. One. Due. Due. Two. Ooh. <laughs> tre. Tre. Three. Quattro. Quattro. Ooh. <laughs> which is four. Cinque. Cinque. Whoa. Five. Whoa. We did it. We counted to five. <laughs> okay. So we learned how to count in five to five in Italian. Maybe we can learn how to say our colors. <laughs> Rosso. Rosso. Red. Verde. Verde. Green. Ooh. <laughs> Giallo. Giallo. Yellow. Yellow. <laughs> and your two favorite colors. Orange and blue. 
Yes. Arancione. Arancione. Orange. Orange. <laughs> and blue. 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 <laughs> Whoa! That was so awesome. But I still feel a little bit hungry. Hmm. Maybe Francesca can teach us some food. Okay. So, cibo. Cibo. Food. Ooh. <laughs> Aqua. Aqua. Water. Water. <laughs> Pane. Pane. Bread. <laughs> Torta. Torta. Cake. Cake. I love cake, especially birthday cake. Do you like cake too? <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Pizza. 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 <laughs> well, that one was pretty easy. Well, thanks so much for teaching us Italian, Francesca. You're welcome, Blippi. Hey, will you dance the pizza dance with us? Of course. <laughs> yeah. And you can dance along too. Let's go. <laughs> I'm so excited to do the pizza dance with you. Okay, stand up and dance along with us. <laughs> yeah. Step into my kitchen for a very tasty treat. With saucy sauce and cheesy cheese, these flavors can't be beat. Your mouth will start to water when you see what we can make. A little piece of Italy, the most delicious bake. Grab some dough, roll that dough, and toss it in the air. Then take a scoop of saucy sauce and spread it everywhere. Don't forget your toppings, extra cheese, sure sounds nice. Open wide and take a bite of a warm, delicious slice. That was awesome! Woo! Great job! It was so much fun, Blippi. Thank you for having me here. Oh. It was so nice to have you. And thank you for dancing along and learning with us. Bye, Francesca. Bye, everyone. Bye, Blippi. That was so awesome! <laughs> we learned about so much today. How to make pizza, how to speak Italian. <laughs> it was great! Well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. <laughs> hey, can you spell my name with me? Okay, let's spell it together. P-L-I. P-P-I. Flippy. Good job. Well, I'll see you soon. Bye-bye. Come on, everyone. Let's make learning. And today we're at Creation Station in Studio City, California. Yeah, I love this place. This is a place where you can dance. Yeah, they have dance lessons here. And you know I love dancing. But first, I have someone really special to introduce to you. Hey, Blippi. Hey, Mika. <laughs> Hi, everyone. This is Mika. She's my best friend. Oh, Blippi, you're my best friend. <laughs> oh, so silly. <laughs> Are you ready to dance? I'm so excited! Yeah, let's go! Come on! Whoa! Whoa. Well, we should probably warm up before we do some dancing today. Yeah, good idea. Look at all these things we can warm up to. Oh, yeah! Cones! Whoa. Check them out! Look at the colors! We have a yellow cone. Orange. <laughs> Ooh! Bluish purple. Purple. <laughs> Ooh, another orange one. Ooh. <laughs> Green. Use our feet for some agility. Ready? Yeah, go for it. Whoa. Really fast, Blippi? Yeah. Whoa. 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 Hey. Whoa. Whoa. Yeah. Why don't we try hula hooping? Okay. Here we go. You put it around your waist and you. Whoa. Three orange balls. Whoa, can you juggle? Yep, I can. Woo, yeah, whoa, whoa. Whoa, <laughs> whoa look at these. Huh. All right, what can we do with these? Hmm. I have an idea. Why don't we toss them to each other at the same time? Yeah, let's try it. Ready? Yep. Three, two, one. Whoa, whoa. three, two, one. Whoa. All right. Whoa, nice. whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. Oh. <laughs> All 
All right, are we warming up the stretch? Yeah, let's do some stretches. All right. Yeah. Oh. Set your toes. Oh. Oh yeah. Feels oh. good to stretch. Yeah, it does. Ooh. Nice leg stretching. Now we're Ooh. gonna be able to dance really good. Yeah, I cannot wait to dance. Do you hear that? Yeah, it sounds like beautiful music. Yeah, I wonder if someone's dancing to the music. Let's go see. All right, let's go. dancer and I was just doing some ballet. Wow. Would you guys like to learn some ballet with me? Yeah! <laughs> Excellent. Um, come on over to the bar. We'll oh, okay. get you guys all set up. Whoa, cool bar. Real what is ballet? this? Thank you. Uh, this is our ballet bar. Wow. Our professional ballerinas learn balances and how to be more flexible all with this bar. Wow. So the first thing a ballerina needs to know is first position. You're going to get those feet together nice and tight. And just open up your toes like a pizza pizza. Pizza. And then stand up super tall, yep. And I like to only put two fingers on the bar so we're not putting too much weight on it, but just enough to stand super tall. Okay. Hello. Yeah. <laughs> now there are some ballet moves that we need to know because they're important, and then there are some that are just super fun. Oh. So we're gonna start with one that's important. Okay. We always use plie. Can you guys say plie? Plie. plie. Excellent. We're just gonna bend down but keep tall. Okay. Yep, and then stand it back up. And then Whoop. down. And oh, Lippy, you look like a real ballet dancer. Yeah. yeah. Do you guys think you know what plie might mean? Sweet. Our knees do it when we do the plie. You're bending. Yes, that's so good. Plie means to bend. Oh, oh that makes sense. We kind of look like frogs, though. Yeah. Like we're about to <laughs> jump in the exactly. air. Exactly. That's what we're Whoa, really? Yep. We're going to take that plie and we're going to jump straight up into the sky. Wow. And land back in that first position. Whoa. Wow. Yep. That was and that really move cool. is called saute. Can you guys say saute? Saute. Perfect. Saute means to jump. jump. You got it. You guys yeah. are so smart. Whoa. 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 Sweet. Good. Okay, another important one. So that one was super fun. Yeah. Huh? Another yeah. important one. Passe. You're gonna slide that toe up to your oh. knee, finding your balance, keep that knee pushed back, stand super tall, and you're gonna stand lower back down. So it's kind of like an oh. elevator ride. Your toe takes up the leg, do 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 Toe's going for a ride. And then yeah. back down to first position. Whoa. <laughs> okay. Whoop, 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 whoop. Excellent. Whoop, whoop. You guys are pro. <laughs> <laughs> That's so good. Wow. That is really fun. One more at the bar. Okay. okay. Also super important. Okay. okay. Tondu. Tondu. Yep. It's kind of like what you did next door. It's the first thing I do in the morning. <sighs> it means to stretch. Oh, okay. I love stretching. Oh. And it's for our leg and our ankle. So you're going to stay in that first position. And you're going to do your best to slide that toe forward. <sighs> Keep your toe on the floor and then slide it back. Oh, Perfect. Wow. And then use the other leg. Slide it forward as far as you can and stretch. And cool. then bring it back to first. Oh, that feels yeah. good. Yeah, yeah. It does. Ton do. Do. Ton do. Do. Excellent. Whoa. So that's to the front. But you can also go side. Okay. Whoa. And to the other side. Whoa. And you can also go back. Ooh. Whoa. And then you can connect all those tondus and make kind of like a circle around your Whoa, Oh, this is fun. Yeah, it kind of nice. feels like skating. Yeah. Woo, we learned a lot of ballet 
already. Yeah, so many cool. words, huh? Wow. Now we're gonna, if you can help me move this bar, I'm gonna teach you just like two or three more fun oh. words, and then we can put two music. Okay. okay. <laughs> Thank right. you. There we go. You got enough space there? Yeah. Perfect. Okay, we're gonna stay in that first position. Okay, okay. feet are first. together, toes are open. Let's push our hands on our hips. Yes. <laughs> we remember saute. Saute. So Means to jump. 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 Excellent. So we're going to do eight super quiet sautés. Oh, ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That was perfect. <laughs> now we're going to jump open. Whoa. Whoa. This All is right. called a chapeau. A chape. That's a new word. Yeah, it is. It's kind of like a jumping jack, so it's super easy. Just jump open, use that plie, and then jump close. You got it. A chape. A chape. One more. A chape. Perfect. Yeah. Nice. Wow, we did really so good. good. Can I give you one more jump? Yeah. Sure. Okay, instead of being in first, I want you to take your heel to your toe. Boop, 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 boop. This is called fifth position. Fifth. Okay. Yeah. So this jump, we call it shangma, and it means to change. Oh. So all you have to do is jump up in the air and land with your other foot in front. Okay. Oh. Can we try? <sighs> yeah. One, Sounds tricky. Two, three, shangma. <laughs> you did it. Wow. <laughs> yeah. That was perfect. Let's try to do three shangmas in a row. All right. Ready? Okay. Yep. Shangma. Oh. Okay. Two. Shangma. Three. Shangma. I don't know, do we want to put it to music? Yeah, sure. that sounds fun. Yeah. All right, let's hit that music. All right. too if you guys want to learn it. Yeah. Yeah. What style is it? Tap dance. <gasps> yeah. yeah! That means we have to change our shoes and then we'll come right back. Okay. All right, let's All right. go! Let's yeah. All right. Wow! wow. Yeah. You guys put your shoes on super fast. Yeah, so excited. Oh, you did too. Yes, wow. thank you. Okay. Two important things to know about our tap shoes before we start. Okay. okay. The tap shoe has two metal shiny parts, right? Oh, uh huh. Wow, they do. Okay, we have oh. to learn what they're called. Okay. So up here, I mean, what's in that part of your tap shoe? Are your fingers in there? No. Oh, it's your toes. toes. So we're gonna call this the toe. Okay. 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 The other part is called the 
heel, heel to heel, exactly right. So the first few things we learn are gonna be super easy peasy. Put that leg out, don't let it move, but you gotta tap your toe. Ooh, I love that sound. Excellent. Good. Can we try the other foot? Perfect. Now we're gonna use the same part of your shoe, but you're gonna put it behind you. Oh, uh-huh, it's called knock knocks. Try the other foot. Knock, knock, knock. Knock, knock, knock. Excellent. <laughs> now with the knock, knocks, you can switch. Hey. Ah, nice. Then you can jump. <laughs> Excellent. Very Whoa. good. Whoa. Nice, That's Lindy. You too, Mika. And use our heels. Ooh, okay. Put it out in the front seat and dig, dig, dig. Dig, dig, dig. Excellent. Very good. Let's try the other foot. Dig, dig, dig. Dig, dig, dig. You got it, you guys. So easy. The next one is going to be a shuffle. Ooh. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Can we say shuffle step? Shuffle, shuffle step. step. How many sounds do you think a shuffle step is? Shuffle step. Three. Three sounds. Yeah. You got it. So we're gonna start like, kind of like a flamingo bird. Whoa, find the balance. And we sweep the floor. Sweep the floor. Perfect. Now what's important with the shuffles is that our heels don't touch. This is just for the toes. So keep your heel off, just your toe. Shuffle. Yeah, man. Oh, that was very good. Okay, I'll try. Shuffle. Holy good cow. Job. That was perfect. You're a tap dancer. Yeah, I am. <laughs> okay, we're gonna learn an even harder one. Okay. Oh, this one is a paradiddle. Whoa. Paradiddle. One, two, three, four. Perfect. Four sounds. Mm -hmm. We start with that dig. When you pick up your foot, you're gonna hit the floor. You got it, and then set it down. Toe heel. Toe heel. Yeah, you got it. Let's try right. the other leg. Dig.
teaching us how to tap dance. You're welcome. Excellent memories, too. Ah, so thank you. You're a great teacher. Thank you. Yeah. You know, I have another teacher here who teaches another style of dance if you are up to learning one more style. Yeah! yeah. He teaches hip-hop. <gasps> hip-hop sounds really cool. Yeah, it does. Yeah. His name is Mr. Caden, and he's just down the hall. Here, follow me. OK, we're going to get our shoes yeah, first, though. Yeah, shoes. OK. Mr. Caden, I'm a hip hop instructor here at Creation Station. Wow, that was really good. Yeah, that was Thank good. you. Do you guys want to learn some hip hop moves? Yeah. 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 Okay, well, first, do you guys know what hip hop is? Hmm. A type of dance? Yeah. Yes, it is a type of dance, but it's like all types of dance mixed together into one. Wow. wow. Cool. cool. Yeah, it's like ballet dancing and tap dancing and jazz dancing all put together. Wow! And there we have hip hop. Yeah! Yeah! Okay. Well, do you want to move, learn some moves? Yeah! yeah. Okay. Yeah. Ready? First, yeah. we're gonna dust off our shoulders. Ready? Oh, we're gonna dust? take our left hand and we're gonna dust off our shoulder. Oh, like it's dirty! Yeah! <laughs> Ready? And then we're gonna do it to the other side. Okay. And dust it off. Whoa. Dusting our shoulders. Yeah! <laughs> whoa! Whoa! Yeah. <laughs> Wow, you guys are so good at that. Oh, thank you. <laughs> you too. Oh, thank you. Okay, ready? Do you want to learn another move? Yeah. yeah. So we're going to raise the roof. Raise Whoa. the roof. Ready? You're going to take your hands. You're going to place them up like they're on the ceiling. Like that. And ready? You're going to push the ceiling up. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, that's it's really deep. heavy. Yeah. Right? Raise the roof. Yeah. Raise the roof. Wow. Raise, raise the roof. The roof. <laughs> raise the roof. <laughs> Perfect. Wow. You guys are really good at hip hop. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Ready? Another move. We're going to put our pants on. Ready? All we do is we're going to grab it and put it up. Oh, okay. Whoa. Yeah. So ready? Grab your pants and put them on. Okay. Oh. We're going to do it to the other side. Ready? All right. Grab your pants and put them on. Oh. Yeah. Let's cool. try it one more time. Ready? Okay. Grab your pants, put them on. Whoa. Other side. Grab your pants, put them on. Whoa. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Woo. <laughs> okay. Ready? Huh? We're gonna learn another hip hop move. Whoa! Whoa. So many moves! <laughs> <laughs> Ready? We're gonna do a hip hop slide. Do you guys like water slides or anything like that? Yeah! yeah. We love going down slides! <laughs> so much fun! Well, ready? We're gonna learn a hip hop slide. So, all you're gonna do, you're gonna take your hand and push it away. At the same time, you're gonna slide your feet over to the right side. Oh, oh okay. Whoa. Whoa! You do the exact same thing on the other side. Take all your right. right hand. Push it away, left foot, slide. Whoa! Whoa. Ready to try one more time. Ready, slide to the right. Whoa! Whoa. And slide to the left. Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> I messed up. <laughs> totally okay. Yeah. Ready? We're gonna learn a super cool move. <gasps> okay. Okay. Yay. This is called a floor spin. What? <gasps> what? Whoa! <laughs> okay, all you're gonna do, you're gonna stay on the floor. Ready? Let's stay on the floor. All right. Okay. Ready? We're gonna sit with our feet out, just like this. All, right. all you're gonna do, make sure you have all your weight on your hands behind you. Okay. okay. So all your weight on your hands. Yeah, yep. I think so. Ready? All you're gonna do is you're gonna push your hands around and then strike a pose. Whoa! Yeah! yeah. All right. Ready? Do you guys wanna try it? Yeah! yeah. Ready? Ready? Let's go. Here Ready? Go. And go! Whoa! Whoa. You guys did so good. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, now that we've learned all those hip hop moves, do you want to put it into a fun hip hop combo? Yeah! Okay, ready? Let's stand up and dance. Yeah, okay. Let's do it. <laughs> Woo! So, first, we're going to start with raising the roof. Let's go. Okay. Yeah. Woo!
that was so fun. Oh, thank you so much for teaching us how to dance hip hop style. Yeah, of course. So fun to move our bodies like that. <laughs> yeah. So, so far we've learned how to do some ballet. Yep. And tap. And hip hop. Yeah, three different styles of dance. Oh, maybe Mika and I, we should have a show. Yeah, oh, let's do it. Yeah. It can be the Blippi and Mika dance recital. Yeah, do you want to come to the show? Yes, I'd love to come. All right, okay. see you there. See you there. Yeah. Welcome to the Blippi and Mika dance recital. Hope you enjoy. you like doing most today, Mika? Mm. Oh, I really love tap dancing with those cool tap shoes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what was your favorite? Hmm, let's see. Well, I love tap dancing. That was cool. Yeah. Hip hop was awesome. Oh, yeah. And ballet was so beautiful. Yeah. <laughs> All three were so cool. Yeah. Well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Mm -hmm. Will you spell my name with me? B-L-I-P-P-I. Blippi, good job. <laughs> Wait a second. Mika, how do you spell your name? Oh, I'll show you. M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. Cool. All right, see you again. See you soon. Bye-bye. Come on, everyone. Let's make money fun. Blippi, Blippi. So much to learn about. It'll make you wanna shout, Whippy!